My name is Vaibhav Singh, I'm a typeface designer. Well, I think absolutely crucial. Uh, there's no way that dialogue across boundaries can exist without this kind of a you know, non-business, non-confrontational uh, encounter. So this is the perfect platform, yeah. I think I think the basis of any kind of visual form making does have uh, you know some intellectual thought behind it. I think there is there has been a sort of uh, division between the idea of purely formal experimentation and the thinking that kind of goes on separately. But as you see in anything uh, that is new, for instance, or something of a new encounter, you see that there is absolutely no way that you could. Uh, differentiate between these things. There is no boundary between sort of thinking and doing, for instance, because they kind of tie in together. So I don't think um, it's necessarily the case that um, because of um, no Latin scripts being coming into um, focus now, that's going to be uh, sort of a you know a new thing. I mean, it it probably is a matter of approach. Really, it's not really something that you could say it's happening because of one phenomenon, but yeah, I think that's what I would think about. Oh yes, absolutely. In fact, I think we need more uh, type designers to be typographers and more typographers to be type designers because it's really such a symbiotic relationship. There is no way to isolate these two things and then it doesn't exactly produce the best results if you don't know what you're, or if you have a sort of you know, fantastical idea, for instance, as we were looking at a few things. I mean, you could always imagine that this is how it's going to be used, but then you need to kind of be in touch with uh, sort of actual work going on, the thinking in other fields, which ties all of these things together and makes your work more relevant. Hmm, tough one. Uh, I think I think there's been quite a lot of um, interesting technical developments in terms of enabling scripts which have much more complex uh, you know, formation. So I don't think there is um, anything particularly hindering uh, that development. I think it's a constant uh, process of improving really uh, than than to actually sort of have something that would be a single you know. Uh, a wish to be fulfilled in a sense. I think all we are trying to do is trying to sort of build better and better tools to achieve better and better communication in a sense. So yeah, I would think, I would think it's a continuous process rather than an individual uh, milestone. Oh yes, uh, that is true. Uh, <laughs> well, non-Latin actually is not a useful term at all because um, well, really, what we've got is typographies uh, of typographies of you know different scripts. So there is Arabic, there is you know Devanagari, there is Gujarati. So I don't see the reason for bunching or separating two things again. Um, there are typographies and multiple typographies, and they're all coming together in a very interesting manner because the more we sort of see boundaries dissolve, the more we see you know uh, things develop across um, sort of barriers more interesting encounters are going to happen and um, that's one of the most exciting things about the field that we need to stop thinking about barriers and we need to stop start thinking about you know coming together in a sense so that would be my view on it